Good morning. Welcome to Dino D, American Foreigner in the Philippines YouTube channel. Please subscribe, click the like button, and leave a comment. Let me know what you might want me to talk about, please. Today I have a very interesting news story about the COVID-19 in the Philippines, what they're doing now to let people come back in or to be able to fly into it. If you're fully vaccinated, you can now come into the Philippines. Uh, so stay tuned and watch the video. Thanks. From the original 14 days, Fully vaccinated individuals arriving in the Philippines from abroad will now only be required to undergo a seven-day quarantine period. This is according to the COVID-19 Task Force, which agreed to relax testing and quarantine protocols. Lahat ng papasok na fully vaccinated individuals ay kailangan sumailalim sa seven-day facility-based quarantine pagdating ng Pilipinas. Kailangan tiyakin ang strictong symptom monitoring habang nasa quarantine facility ng pitong araw. Pagkatapos ito ay magsiself-monitor na ang pasahero. According to the IATF, an individual is considered fully vaccinated at least two weeks after receiving their second dose of COVID-19 vaccine or two weeks after being administered with a single-dose vaccine. Presidential spokesperson Harry Roque says these individuals will only be required to take an RT-PCR test if they manifest COVID-19 symptoms during their seven-day facility-based quarantine. Pagkatapos makakompleto ng pitong araw sa facility-based quarantine, mag-issue ang Bureau of Quarantine ng quarantine certificate kung saan nakalagay ang vaccination status ng pasahero. Roque meanwhile clarified that these relaxed protocols will only apply to individuals who have been vaccinated in the Philippines and that Filipinos or foreign nationals inoculated abroad would still need to comply with the IATF's regular testing and quarantine protocols after arriving in the country. He says the IATF will soon release new guidelines for inbound passengers who have been vaccinated outside the country. Meanwhile, the Department of Health is studying the possibility of placing green lanes in ports and airports that would reduce the mandatory 14-day quarantine and skip COVID-19 testing requirements for fully vaccinated individuals. The DOH says these green lanes may be implemented as soon as the Philippines reaches several vaccination targets. Ang recommendation ay uh, merong 30% as a ating mga eksperto na population coverage yan tinatawag. Pero ang isa nilang gustong ipunto rin, gusto nilang makita na at least 50% of senior citizens are also vaccinated. Walang final, ito ay mga re recommendasyon pa lang. Meanwhile, the Philippine government has also exempted from the ongoing travel ban the repatriation efforts for Filipinos stranded in India, Pakistan, Nepal, Sri Lanka, Bangladesh, Oman, and the United Arab Emirates even if these were not organized by the Philippine government. The IATF says all Filipino repatriates from these countries must be able to present a negative RT-PCR test result taken within 48 hours prior to boarding the aircraft or vessel back to the Philippines. The IATF says government-organized repatriation, meanwhile, must coordinate with government agencies such as the Department of Foreign Affairs and OWA at least 48 hours before departing for the Philippines. Pia Gutierrez, ABS-CBN News.